Good evening, folks. This is Darth Ravage 07 coming to you tonight with another quick review. This time it's none other than the Buzzworthy Bumblebee Worlds Collide 4 pack, including Nemesis Primal, Fangry, Bumblebee, and Black Arachnia. And of these guys, I have just really grown, really, you know can't believe how much i really did want this pack i mean of repaints this guy is absolutely amazing to have in hand with the purples and the black and when you get into robot mode is even another side of him that is just really awesome that the other release does not give you then fangry here uh finally gets a grotesque retool just give it a look at there that snout and it will close and it will open and open more ah. <laughs> uh, and he also has the little deal where the head is supposed to go in and tell you his speed strength and intelligence and inside of the chest there of course is the Titan Master, so we can pop this open real quick. I'll let you see in there. There is his headmaster. Anyway, we'll get that transformed a little bit later there. And then we have yellow cliff jumper repainted as Bumblebee. <laughs> Retooled head. In robot mode, we'll show you that. I wish they would have painted those back tail lights, but it's okay. And those little guys, I might take the silver to it a little bit later. I might even paint my own tail lights in there. This is an excellent mold. I was not expecting to get another one of these. So there's that. And we have Predacon Black Arachnia. And I've already done the leg swap. This was the second reason why I bought this pack. And in fact, I mean, the colors on this just, they really, really did, a, they knocked it out of the park. Uh, giving her all this detail here. The eyes. I love that she can hold the heart spark like she's calculating her next moves there. And I love how the black legs from the original release make this even more of a spectacle. Then this looks like either a cross between a Skeltula from Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time or a Brainiac's new mothership. Depending on how you pivot and hold it. When I first transformed it, I had a major gap right there. It didn't seal kind of like this one did. I got it kind of worked down there. Anyway, I just love that one more time there. Boom, Brainiac thing going on there. So we're going to get these guys off camera, transformed into their robot modes. Take a closer look and finish off this quick review. Thanks again to all the 330 folks that have subscribed to my channel. I really do appreciate you guys hanging in there with me. And let's get these guys transformed in three two one and here is our four pack team in their robot modes well his little edb robot mode is now getting ready to jump up here before we do that well let's take a look at that guy and he holds up and then slams down his head into the port there on the top. Give me just a moment.
And sorry about the dead space there. Got him into his head mode and connected. And let's just take a closer look at each and every one of these guys here. There's Optimus Primal. And of course, that face mask being over his face just does something for me. I like the little Predacon symbol there at the top of his crest there. And then here's Fangry. Look at all Fangry. Bumblebee doing what he does best. This feels like a G.I. Joe crossover waiting to happen for some goofy reason. And Black Arachnia holding the Allspark that comes with the set. That's pretty diabolical of her. And uh, we've seen these transformations before in other reviews or what have you. And these guys are just nice to have in hand finally instead of watching everybody else you know get it and talk about how cool it is they are actually this cool and uh hopefully those that are still looking will be able to find theirs in the near near future i just uh really needed to get these yesterday and found them an hour and a half away at a target out of town drove down real quick grabbed it and really glad i did uh yeah, I like this a lot more than I thought I was going to. This is a really solid Bumblebee. If you don't got the Netflix Bumblebee, it's got the Netflix head. Uh, this is one of many of the headmasters from Titans Returns. Uh, this mold monster is a grotesque monster bot, you know, and then. Nemesis Primal having the addition of the mask that Optimus Primal wore in season one's finale for the Nemesis face. That is just spot on awesome. Uh, really like the weapons details as well. Uh, this guy didn't come with any weapons, but uh, he's got his little red swords there. And once they're in his hands, I mean, he's, he's awesome. Give me just a second. We get a very awesome teal blasters popped up out of his arms there with the swords displayed out there and uh this set doesn't disappoint if you can get a hold of it i highly suggest you do do not hesitate and uh you won't regret it i don't think that's about going to do it for this four pack of worlds collide figures Thanks again to Jasmine and Nick at the Woodruff Road Target. Uh, I really do appreciate you guys working together, getting this to guest services, being held for me long enough for me to drive down and grab my set here. And uh, till all are one, guys, y'all have an excellent, safe week. Man, this this is really really cool. I'm really grateful to have it here in my hands. Y'all have a good week out there. Till all are one. Thanks again for watching.